Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we are going to set up OpenGL Glot.h with CodeBlux. For that, you will have to download two files. Firstly, you have to download the CodeBlux 17.12 with MINGW compiler. And after having this file, I will provide you the link. You have to install it using an installer by double clicking it. As I already have it installed, I will cancel it for now. And after finishing the setup, you need to extract the all the files that you get from the second link, which will contain another folder inside which there will be these files. Glot.h, Glot32.dll, Glot32.liv. You have to copy these files in some of the specified folders. You can follow along with me. First of all, you copy the glot.h file in the folder as I will show you. First, Control C or let me show you. I will copy it into. You go to the C drive, program files x86, code box, min gw, include gl. Inside here, you have to paste it. As I already have the glot.h file, I will replace the file in the destination. You will be asked for the permission. You may continue. Okay. Now you will have these files in this folder. Okay. Let me show you the complete path. This is the path where your blood dot h will go. And similarly, you will have to copy glot32.liv and paste it inside minzw lib. Right here, I'm going to paste the file. Okay, let's do right click in the empty space and paste it. And similarly as earlier, I already have glot32.liv here. Still, I'm going to replace the file in the destination. For this as well, you will be asked for the permission. You may continue. After having this, the final file that you need to place somewhere is the glot32.dll. You need to copy this and go back to the C drive. I'm going to the C drive. Then after Windows. And then after System. Okay, and paste it here. If you already have the file there, then you will be shown this prompt. If you do not have, you need to paste it. Or if you already got it, then you don't need to. Still for the tutorial, I'm overriding the files. And similarly, do paste the same file inside system32. I'm going to replace the file and continue. After having this, all the files copied to the necessary directories, we may now open code blocks. After the code block is open, you may now create a new project by clicking File, New, and Project. 
here you may select glot project go next and give it a name i'm going to give it a name test glot and a random number one two three test glot one two three is my project for now and here you have to specify the location of glot and we have installed the required header files inside programs x86 core blocks min zw inside here inside the include and lib we have copied all the necessary information that is why we are going to select this minzw is our root compiler folder and in next and click finished after you click finish you will have a project with a code main.cvp to run this code you need to include windows dot h save it and build and run it if you can see these three objects is spinning the setup of glot.h is, is perfect if you have any issue you may repeat the video and follow the instructions carefully step by step If you like the video, please like, comment and subscribe. Thank you.